Yo, what's up everybody? It's Superfly Fat Guy 859 coming at you again. Well guys, I wanted to do a quick little video. Um I cleaned some junk out of my car um today. Just some stuff that like, you know, a couple restaurant cups and stuff like that. And um I went to get grab see if there was anything under the seat and uh I found some wire that I had under the seat that I had bought to fix something on my car. So I took it to the trunk and uh, popped open my um, my toolbox and I saw something and I was like, you know what, I'd like to do a review on that because I think for the money and if you're if you're looking for um for what you're paying, it's a blade that is pretty remarkable, uh, I think anyway. You know, and let, okay, here's here's basically what it is. I don't. I can't say it, but it's from Switzerland, and uh, Kuhn Rakan. I don't. I have no idea. Um, but it's it's a paring knife, okay? And it comes in this cool little sheath here, and it's it's very inexpensive, guys. I'm talking like whew, uh, for probably three or four dollars, five dollars at the most, maybe. Um, suggested retail I think is like 10 bucks so that tells you right there <coughs> um, but it, it's a very very inexpensive way to have a blade that uh, I think is very well worth putting in a bug out bag I really do you see some scratches there when I grabbed this out of the trunk I was like you know I'm going to cut some stuff with it and see exactly how sharp it is. And um, and then maybe, you know, if I if I like it enough, I'll do a video about it. And I, I feel like this is something that would be great for a bug out bag. Um, absolutely fantastic. I mean, you could do food processing with it. Um, you could do little, li I mean, you know, you're not going to baton with this. It's got a plastic handle for Christ's sakes. Um but you know little stuff little stuff uh maybe if you're going foraging you know cut berries out of trees and um fruit out of trees and maybe cut some uh uh some you know edible plants and stuff like that and cut those down i mean it it can be used for a wide array of things and i think to clash the the knife community and the prepping community or survivalist community, whatever, um, and, and mold them together. Uh, I think this is kind of the best of both worlds because, it, you know, it is a blade, obviously, but it's also, I think for the money, I think it would be a perfect blade, maybe just a backup or a backup to the backup or whatever. Um, I just think it's a fantastic uh, little blade for a bug out bag. And this was in my toolbox, and I think it's, I'm, I think I'm going to take it out of there, and I think I'm going to throw it in the old bug out bag because it's a sweet little blade. Uh, but that's my video guys I just want to do a quick little video for you um, and tell you that I processed several boxes uh, cereal boxes and several um, magazines with this I didn't get it on tape or anything or camera whatever uh, but I mean it, it went it just like butter just straight through it like butter um, I don't really know anything about it it's just they, they call it a carbon steel or a high carbon steel or something like that on the website but um anyway i just wanted to go ahead and show you guys this is a cheap and expensive way to have a, a decent quality blade in your bug out bag for many different uses all right take care guys